Hello and welcome back to Diablo 3. Um, we've jumped into just bounties and exploration at Torment 9 because we're going to try and get my brother some more of his season journey and he has a selection of bosses that he needs to take out. Let's have a look. Whereabouts is the uh, Tower of the Cursed level 1? Oh yes. There we oh, are. She's actually a bounty at the moment, so... I'll probably bring my zombie dogs out before... Hey, oh, Treasure no. Goblin! Oh, is it a Gilded Baron? No. Well, you know, even more gold. Go with the 360 million that I got in addition to my previous 30 million last time. The only thing that's a, a bit of a shame is, you know, you can't just spend it for the sake of spending it. Um, you pretty much can. I mean,. Every time you're on a rift from this point on, like, it's going to be an empowered rift. That's very true. Um, and I suppose the cost does go up quite drastically. Yes, it really does. Okay, my killing speed is enough that I can take these mobs out. So well, that's good. That's good. That's good to know. Oh, I suppose I should have been paying more attention to uh, the danger that you could have been in. Oh, I'm not in danger. Although, you know, getting one hit by greed uh, twice the last episode did make me think uh, a lot about mortality. So two hit? No, uh, one hit and then uh, a separate time one hit again. <laughs> so two hit? I don't know! <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm still picking up all the gold on the way. Oh right. <laughs> I'm, I'm just running through it all going, I can't leave it. The shinies on the, on the floor. Okay, you do that, I shall <laughs> get us to Sadia. Look, I, I'm in the same area as you now, at least. Ah, since we um, practiced a little offline to see if we were anywhere near being able to do Speed Racer, I feel so slow in my regular build now. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, uh, th there's something about being an angry chicken moving at 350% speed, um, or in your case, constantly horsing around. Yes, perma horse. I don't just mean I braided the tail. <laughs> yeah, I can survive at Torment 9. I don't know if I'd be able to do rifts at Torment 9, but. Uh... Right, so now you want to go fast. Well, no, no, it's just I naturally go fast. Ever so slightly faster than you. Alright, there you go. One down. What's next? Wow. Uh, now, I'm going to... Ooh, a unique mojo. It is not the one I wanted. You need the butcher, didn't you? Okay, yes, so we need to go kill the butcher. It didn't actually announce that to season journey then, which is a little bit annoying. But, uh... Did it count? It did count, thankfully. Well, then, so... welcome to my entire life of season journeys. <laughs> <laughs> which is strange because it announced the one from the higher level. Yeah, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I think it's to do with like whether or not it can get like lag and connection to the uh, servers properly or not. Yeah, I suppose that does sort of make sense. In fact, the, the fact that I'm killing these and doing quite well at it means that I might be able to move up to Format 10 by myself. <gasps> Wow, can we play on Torment 10? We'll I'll see like, how we do it at Rift. I'll have things to do. <laughs> but yes, we might be able to. Pretty sure it's not this way. I, I'm pretty certain it's not exactly where I'm standing fighting mobs, but at the same time I'm practicing, so... Is it where you are? It's not showing up on my mini map with this bit. Um, I'm going to head back down this. Uh... Yeah, maybe it is where I am. Let's, uh, run I'm going to head all the way down the end here. Yeah, it's over here. 
Okay, I'll teleport to you in a moment. And of course, uh, the better my legendary gems get, the more damage I'll be doing to everything and uh, etc. etc. So, yep. uh, I'll just accept. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Did you see him pause there? That's my new weapon. Well, you you made him think about his life. Yeah, basically. It's, I All mean, right. it it kind of doesn't really work with my build design, which is mostly about people hitting me and hurting themselves. But <laughs> I don't know. It it kind of feels alright. <laughs> okay, right. Let me just salvage the bits that I've picked up there. I guess at this point there is still a reason to run uh, bounties for re-rolling uh, legendary items. Oh, isn't absolutely! There? I haven't done that at all yet because I think it takes five per re-roll. Yeah, I've I've got forgotten souls coming out of my ears. I've got 131 of them. That's not um, coming out of your ears, believe me. Okay, well I I, I feel like I have many. The re-roll takes fifty. Fifty? Yes. <gasps> yeah, that's why, one of the reasons why I've just never bothered. Yeah, wow. I mean, wow. Yeah, I would okay. rather like spend 25 Death's Breath and craft up a new thing and have a chance at the right item than reforge an existing one at this stage, but... <laughs> yeah, I suppose. Okay, um... So, Torment 9 Rift in under 6 minutes. No problem. Let's wait for it to tick round to uh, 2228 on my screen, and then I will open up the room. Mine's already 2229, just FYI. There we go. Here we go. So you want me to go fast, yeah? Yes, please. There's nothing in here. <laughs> uh There is, like, nothing in here. It's alright, I'll okay. still be able to do it. Conduit pylon. That's certainly gonna help. Damn shielded things. Man, this rift is so empty. <laughs> All right, there we go. I killed the yellow. <laughs> it really is empty. I, this is so bad. I haven't seen a single blue or yellow. I've, I've killed the yellow. And I've run out of this corner, so I'm coming over, over to you now. May as well teleport to me. I don't know if I can in the... It's not a greater rift. So... <laughs> teleport in the middle of exploding things. Hooray! Okay, so generally life is dangerous at Torment 9, but it is manageable. So, do you still think we're going to do this in the... Crown of Blue. Hey, there's in a the unique thing limit. next to you. Oh, Sorry, need it. <laughs> <laughs> That's alright. <laughs> <laughs> alright, I got that. Alright, a yellow. It's going to be very tough if we do. I mean, I've done the next difficulty level ups one of these, which is like a Torment 10 one in under five minutes. Yeah. That was hard. I guess it just goes to show you can get absolutely shafted by the uh, rift itself. 
Yeah, by the rift draw. Alright, it's been two minutes so far. So I think we're probably going to be okay. Alright, way down. Yellow's good. Okay, I'm going to carry on fighting on this level for the moment. Annoying not back yellows, but they're yellows. Okay, I am on my way to you. Blues. Now, I've noticed some of the Witch Doctor uh, items, or one of the Witch Doctor items, um, gives like a 15% chance to summon a fetish for 60 seconds when you attack. Yes. Is there a limit on the maximum number of fetishes? You can yeah, it's about 13 or 14, I think. That's still a lot. Yeah, I think like you can very briefly get it up to 17. Uh, if you like activate Fetish Army at the same time or yes. something. Yes. Just because Fetish Army comes with, like, one of the uh, runes in it comes with five extra fetishes. <laughs> right. Uh, I used the, the Tiki Torch as one um, for extra flamey goodness. Alright, we're at four minutes. We may have to do this again, tragically. Do we have to do it tragically? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, I, I took a screenshot uh, just the other day because I found an item called Tragedy Birthright. <laughs> <laughs> hey, found some blues. Molten's annoying. Are you actually scared of Molten's at this level? Um, I, I, I pay a little attention to them. Unique spear. Yeah, I got a unique potion. I should ID it later. Oh, I don't think we're going to have time. We're at five minutes. Oh, shielding bastard. Give it up. There we go. Alright, I'll leave you to deal with that. Yeah. I mean, I can kill a Rift Guardian in stupid time. Oh, right, he's time. here. He's here by me. Coming. Not yet. Uh... Oh, you go back to town. Heading back. How is it from when you... Uh... Actually, I think it's when you actually kill him? kill him that I've never wanted to test. Right. I don't know how long that was, but I'll check my season journey in just a moment and see if it's ticked it off. I'm just going to gather all these things. <laughs> all right. Did not do it. It did not count. So we're going to have to try that again. Do you want Kool Aid? Um, no. Oh, wait, a uh, potion. No, thanks. Uh, I've already got one. Oh, guess what? I found an Imperial Messenger. Oh, I thought it was going to be <laughs> another puzzle ring. As, as funny as that would be, salvage that up. And we'll get it. Actually, let's get rid of that as well. I 
Okay, now what could I in theory do to make my pets better? We could forgo the extra resistance for stuff nearby. No. Life up by 20%. I could spot that over for damage up by 50%. You know, I think we've, had, we've totally got this. It's just that that was a shit rift. It was. Um, but I'm now doing plus 50% damage on everything as well. Well, I suppose that'll help a bit. Uh, I just need another 10 seconds before I can come with my gargantuan again. Alright, uh, just waiting for the time to tick round. To what? It's 22.37. Uh, We're just going to sit here for four minutes? It's 22.36 at the moment, so when it hits 37 exactly, I'm going to change it, because then I will know how long we have. Mine's just gone 38. So mine's about to go 37, and eh, there we go. You know, you could just get a stopwatch. Nope. <laughs> I could also just use my phone, but nope. There's nothing in this rift. Stupid teleporting bastard. Got ya. Amulet, unique sword, unique ring. Power pylon. That's going to make a big difference. A uh, unique belt. Maybe that ring's a puzzle ring. That would be funny, but... Hey, set games. shoulders! What is this, like the apology rift? <laughs> it is uh, very different. Oh, I'm sorry, last rift was so shit. Here, have a power pylon and all the packs that you can handle at once. Another blue pack. And that's one that I don't want to get near. Arcane? Nope. <laughs> More arcane than frozens. Okay. Unique two handed nice. Not ready yet. I'll tell you what, the drops are quite good. There's a set item over here. It's a set belt. So that's like six uniques that I've picked up in this thing. Just, yeah, so far. And we are one and a bit minutes in so far. I think this one is definitely going to happen <laughs> in the time limit. <laughs> Just you wait, the next half of this rift will be nothing. And another unique, unique braces. I almost don't want to end this rift. Yeah. I, I think after we've killed whatever it is, um, I'll just check my season journey and see if uh, we need to actually close it or if it counts just at that point. Another yellow. <laughs> this is a, a very amazing rift. I am quite astounded. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely doing significant amounts of damage uh, with these uh, walls of the dead. Good. And your health doesn't seem too bad. I guess you're probably a little bit further back than you were. <laughs> yeah, a, a little bit, and then I got hit by um, <laughs> one of those lob bomb things. And it took off like 90% of my health. <laughs> But that's okay, I am managing. Shout if you need help. I'm okay. I'm good. It's frozen, so I'm just running away.
still totally fine. Right, I've got another There's blue another pack here. You. I'm coming down to you. Okay. Also, you know, for the boss fight, because that'll... Be He's right out. next to me. He's going to die It's a really unique quickly. amulet. Done. Okay. I'm going to check my season journey. It did not count heading back to town. Oh, they're doing that? Close it and then come back and do it. Around everything. It has not ticked it off, but it could be because it's waiting for it to close. And grab the hoops. That's gonna be bad. You've left the okay, game. Okay, I uh <laughs> a minor crash. I'm coming to protect you. I mean, the rift itself will close in just a, yeah, a moment. It's fine now. All right, so I'll uh, give us a minute and we'll get Alex right back. <laughs> oh, you're back and not dead. And uh, in Act 3, apparently. <laughs> yeah, it, it depends on whichever one currently has the, uh, the bounty bonus for where you end up joining. There you are. Uh, but yes... I, I am indeed back. I'm still alive, and that counted for my season journey. Oh, good. Did you say you wanted a Justice Lantern? Um, I always want Justice Lanterns. This is an intelligence ring. <laughs> you didn't specify. Oh, look, give it back. I'll have a look at it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Mm. So I got another uh, Clem's... Uh, buff belt. Clems. Um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. It, it's a stupid name for a stupid belt. I hate it. Uh, got vigilante belt. I can that. Um, Crum's ornament. I think I've got one of those already. I do. Now, this actually increases my attack speed, so I kind of want it, but it's intelligence, which means I really hate it. Uh... <laughs> I could try and reroll the intelligence into like resist all and then it would be no, I don't like it. No, you can have it back, thanks. Okay. And it's uh, it is quite nice, sixteen percent chance to block and that would actually uh, tie quite well with the wait, does that count even if you've got nothing to block? Uh do you mean nothing to block with? Yeah. Don't know actually. This is not something that I felt the need to test. I'm going to put it on and see if my block percent, which I'm assuming would be under defense. It does. Block chance, 16%. Blocked attacks have their damage reduced by 0 to 0. <laughs> That's totally <laughs> worth it. Well, no, because that uh, it can um, uh, synergize quite well with the thing that reduces all incoming damage by 50% if you block it. Um, well, like, what, Justice Lantern, gain damage reduction equal to 70% of your block chance. Yeah. Yeah, and there was something else as well, I, I think, which might be on my... Coven's uh, Criterion? Uh, the shield? It's on my, uh, yeah, it's on my other Templar. Uh, that's exactly it, the, the shield. So that could be um, cubed and then uh, used that way. That um, seems horribly sure. inefficient. I didn't say it was going to be a good idea. All right, let's put the Justice Lantern in there because that okay. is probably going to be worth cubing at some point. Um, Rakos Glass of Life I'll put in there as well. And everything else I'm going to salvage up. Blackthorns Cross. Do I have one? I do have one. That's 76. Oh, yeah. The one I've got is much better. Do you want to jump into a greater rift? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think that would uh, that will be fun. So you were fine at Torment Nine. Uh, yeah, just uh, generally doing a Torment Nine rift was uh, was okay. Is the maximum greater rift you can actually select? Ah, uh, yeah, that's actually a, a very good point. Let me just drop this uh, stuff off, and uh, I will find out. I think because we've done a Torment Nine one, it sets it to that level, but I'm not entirely certain. Oh, that'd be good. 
Okay, so Greater Rift, I can go as high as... Yes, it sets it to that level, so I can go as high as 42, theory. Well, whatever you're comfortable with. Uh, I'm going to talk to Kadala very quickly and just get some mojos. So if I die, at least, you know, there's a chance that I get a cat before I do. Nope, no cats for me. Just salvage these, and uh, we'll go in at, at uh, 40, and uh, that'll actually give me a really good uh, feel for whether I can do... 40 solo sure. as well. And obviously I'll have 15 minutes rather than 6 minutes, which is a big difference. But uh, Okay, so 40 and empowering it costs 19 million. That's alright, we've got plenty. I'm going to not empower it for the moment <laughs> until I'm actually at the point where... Oh I'm... no, my 400 million. Whatever will I do with it? What at all? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Well, no, it's just it's inefficient at the moment because I could do like a Torment 8 rift and yeah, so I'm not going to empower this one. All right, uh, are you ready? Yes. Here we go. To be sure I'm going to empower it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's probably only another 1% chance to upgrade a thing, but it's, it's about time efficiency. Yes. Alright, this is not too bad. Were you expecting it to be? Well, it's always a little bit uh, worrying running into big things like this when uh, I do feel underpowered compared to you. Well, yes, yeah, so I'm running GR50, so. Power pylon. Does that make you feel better? <laughs> it does, actually. Quite a lot. Not this, this way. Is, uh, going quick, to say the least. I can hear your fetishes. Alright, uh, lay down. Not ready yet. And that's without the power pylon, so I'm doing a fair bit of damage to these things. I did have a conduit pylon. Swapping over my uh, skill for the uh, the one that does plus 50% pet damage has made a huge difference because of the way that uh, my skills are synergized anyway. Yeah. Yeah, not running into the middle of all of that. That just seems like a bad idea. <laughs> Exploding things and molten things and more exploding things. At least it wasn't frozen and arcane. This is true. And waller. I'm a big fan of these uh, <laughs> parallel dimension, Hieradric, maze type rifts. Yeah. I, I really, really liked um, Diablo 2, the. Uh, um, what was it? The Forgotten Library? The Arcane Sanctum? That's the one. <laughs> forgotten <laughs> Library. <laughs> I, I, it, it was a long time ago that I, uh, well, that I forgot I it, it wasn't a library. The, just the, the general layout and, and the feel of it was awesome. Found the way down. Alright, dealing with some dudes. Alright, you deal with dudes. There we go. Dealt. Uh, oh, I see over there. Coming around. Patience. <laughs> All of a sudden these barrels start by... Uh, oh, right. You've arrived. <laughs> Yeah, this so rift feels a lot more efficient than the last. <laughs> well, maybe not than the last, 
The last was uh, <laughs> really, really, really fast. This, I think, is actually slightly slower. Yeah, so I've started asking Kadala for rings to uh, hopefully try and get the uh, Legacy of Nightmares set. Uh, yeah, I, I got both of them off her uh, in like almost back to back. Oh, nice. uh, and one of them's ancient as well. Very nice. I am looking forward to attempting the uh, thrill at some point, but probably when I've got more Paragon levels. You won't too. be able to do that with the LON. With the Legacy of Nightmares. Listening at nightmares, whatever. It's no oh. set items. No set items. I thought it was no class. Set. No, it's just no set items. Oh, okay. So you can't well. even use Chrome's belt. <laughs> That's fine because I, I've been getting uh, non-set um, ancient items anyway. Uh, so it's just one that I won't be able to. Yeah, I'll just have to do it old style. Yes, that's why I'm so keen to use hack rather than, I don't know, say something punchy. Better. <laughs> something better. Oh. Two set helms, a set amulet, a unique ring, and a unique voodoo mask. Stupid scoundrel token. Yay! Oh, a 2% chance to upgrade Pain is Stricken and Trapped. Wait, it, you only got one unique with that? Uh, a scoundrel token and a sword thing. That's, yeah. But you're dead happy about that, right? I'm going to do my um, Alton Wildebeest Gizzard because that's improving my life. Now, these helmets look awesome. Basically, I've got three helmets. And, oh, another uh, Traveler's Pledge, I think. Uh Yes, another traveler's pledge. One ah ah ah. Which I'd do a little bit less damage, but I'd have more toughness if I went for it. Although I'd need to reroll probably the life per second into a socket. That took a while. Uh, Araki's visage, that's good. And ooh, an ancient jade harvester's wisdom and split tusk and the tall man's finger. Zombie dogs instead summons a single dog. Yep, big giant dog. Interesting. I think I rely on the um, the many of them. Uh, but an anyway, uh, I think with uh, the boss fights, uh, the uh, the rifts that we've run through, that's probably a good point for us to to take a break there. Oh yeah, uh, definitely. Thank you very much for for watching and uh, join us again soon for more Monday Night Gaming.